So how do I go about getting a forklift license? By far and away, this is our number one question when it comes to forklifts. Well, let me clear up a very common misconception. There is no such thing as a forklift license. I know, I know, you've probably been asked about forklift licenses your entire career. There's a chance you might be applying for a job right now and your prospective employer is asking you for a forklift license. Well, a forklift operation doesn't work like driving a car. You don't go down to the DMV and get a picture and take a test and then get a license that allows you to operate. It just doesn't work that way. So being authorized to operate a forklift at your facility is basically like any other training subject. You need to be trained and evaluated by your employer. There's no license or card that you can get that you can take from employer to employer that proves that you're authorized to operate. You do have to be trained and you do need to have documentation for, of that training, but that's something that is kept with your employer. So I know what you're thinking. How am I supposed to get authorized by my employer to operate a forklift if I don't currently have a job? Who's going to authorize me if forklift licenses don't exist? Well, that's a good question. Unfortunately, most employers don't actually understand the regulations for forklift operation and forklift training. So here's what we recommend. Submit a forklift operator resume sheet as an addendum to your resume. On our website, we have provided a template you can use. You list your formal instruction, forklift types, and work environments. This will provide the information required for employers who are looking to hire prospective forklift operators. You can also beef up formal instruction part of the resume by taking an online course on forklift operation. Now this will not certify you to operate, but it will give you some credentials when applying for a job.